Hello you guys and welcome to my channel. Uh, today what I think I'm going to do is a a blue eye, blue eye look and I don't know. I just felt like doing a blue eye. I'm not really going anywhere. Just came from work. I'm going to use powder on my face. I'm going to do that first. And when you use powder on your face um, before your makeup, if you have oily skin like me, it's going to help absorb that oil. And it's going to also help fill in your pores. And my skin is extremely oily. Because I have some fine lines underneath my eyes. And to me, it just brings it out more. So makes it dry and so I don't do that I don't put powder underneath my eyes okay so we are going to start with our pencil and like I said this is color mates um, dark black brown I mean and so then I use um, I've been using something new lately so I got this from Ulta this is the Maybelline it's called Maybelline Brow Drama. It is. It's in D Brown, 260 D Brown. It's it's cool. It's fine. I don't think it's like a must have, but I've been using it lately and it's decent. Now we're gonna use our concealer. For that, I use a concealer brush. This is the e.l.f. concealer brush. It's like a dollar. Everything that I use, everything that I've been using, like has been like cheaper products, to be honest with you. I don't really have anything like I can say that's really expensive to me. I mean, I've used all that kind of stuff and I end up coming back to just using like the cheaper products because I don't see that big of a difference. Now, that's just me. If I find something that's more expensive and I feel like it works better, then I'm going to use that. So, um, to do my eyebrows, I'm going to use this uh, Maybelline Fit Me and this is in Tam. No, this is in Cafe. So, what we're going to do is just outline. When y'all go to Sephora and they be giving y'all those samples, whatever, you want to try new face stuff, don't just try anything on your face. If you have sensitive skin, do not try anything on your face. I was, I had used some samples or whatever because I wanted to switch up my face routine. When I say that stuff broke me out so bad the stuff that i used it was peter thomas uh raw the um what did i use i used the vitamin c some kind of power vitamin c serum and then i also used uh, lancome ginger feet one of them or the both of them combined broke me out bad. the next thing that we are going to do is we're going to start on our um, eyeshadow so I think what I'm going to do is I'm gonna prime my eyes and so this is um Mac laying low y'all I had this um I have had this for so long y'all it's so dry it is so dry I want to try that uh P Louise primer eyelid things like an eyeshadow shadow primer i'm gonna try that and that's supposed to be real good i don't even know why i'm using this dry ass shit y'all if you have something that's dried out if y'all have something that's dried out like this is do not throw it away use some duraline some ink this is by inglot duraline add it to your cream products and stuff that dries out and it's gonna it'll bring it back to life i'm gonna start with this uh This is Sienna. This is Inglot. This is actually Inglot blush, but I use it on my eyes. And then we're going to use, um, go in with a dark navy or something. So this right here, these are all Urban Decay. Dang. Okay, these are all Urban Decay colors that I put into a um, Z palette. I like this brush. I'm gonna have to get another one of these. This is more. This is Morphe. They don't have. 
have the number on here. I got it from Ulta though. So now what I'm gonna use is this um, Makeup Revolution. Uh, this is Makeup Revolution Conceal and Define. And this is in the color C2. This is the, the next one to the palest color that they have. They have like a white color, it's like porcelain color. That's C1 and this is C2. And this isn't uh, necessarily a cut crease, like it's just, I'm just putting this on top so that you can see. Sometimes I just like to use my finger for things. Oops, my concealer fell. Okay, so once we've done that, we're gonna go back into our crease. We're gonna darken it up to make this more of a smoky eye. And the color um, that I think I'm gonna use is a, it's like an off black color. And I think I'm gonna use that. I'm gonna use my eyeliner. Okay, and I'm gonna use my eyeliner. I think that looks okay. I kinda wanna be extra and put some glitter up there. But, since I'm about to just take this shit right on off. Okay, so we're gonna do our liner. I'm gonna do a winged eye, of course. Mocha 360. I would say this is light to medium coverage. I do not like, um, I do not like full coverage foundation. I don't contour my, um, yeah, I do not contour my nose. I like my nose the way it is. I don't see the reason why everybody gotta have, walk around with a skinny ass beak. That ain't my, I don't know. My nose is good the way it is. Now all of a sudden it's a trend for your nose to be skinny as hell. Okay, this is Fenty Espresso. Fenty Espresso. I love, this is my favorite part. Doing it. Morphe, Morphe Showmance. I 
do not put powder underneath my eyes. I stayed before. Don't like how it looks. Olive sand. a little bit of blush. I need a lip wax bag. I did too much. Okay. So what do y'all think? And I love I don't know why y'all like I can put uh, individual lashes on all day long but when it comes to the strip oh my god I be messing up my makeup trying to do it sometimes I have a beauty mode but it covered gets covered up by makeup so I just put some eyeliner down there so yeah y'all this is it I actually really like how it came out. I thought I wasn't gonna like it, but sometimes you gotta stick it through. Mm -hmm.